I am top Orlando realtor Scott Garrison with Remax Town and Country. We're at 3802 Surrey Drive, Orlando, Florida, 32812. Here near downtown Orlando, this beautiful three bedroom, two bath, charmer, totally redone. Purpose of this video is to give you what you can't see you go online, Zillow, Realtor.com, Trulia, and look at the very best pictures. Why is that? Well, because I'm the one who took and posted those pictures. So people call me and they say, well, what's the property really look like? What's the neighborhood really look like? It's here about 4 o'clock on a weekday. Nice and quiet. It's private. We're on a street end. And there's the end of the street right there no through traffic see the houses are all really maintained no HOA just like everybody wants matter of fact this whole thing this is the kind of house that people are going crazy for and you should go crazy for it too as I'm taking a video right into the Sun here it was built in 1959 this neighborhood effective year built of this home which means it had major updates in 1979 and of course it's been updated a lot since then for sure got a lot of nice landscaping crepe myrtle got camellias there in the front I understand those are plantain trees that's a bird of paradise up over the roof the big avocado in the back so we've got curb appeal got location just a couple of minutes from the 408 expressway which will get you to i4 in just a few minutes all of central florida is no more than 20 or 30 minutes away near downtown orlando this is what people want for sure quiet neighborhood got a basketball goal down there close to shopping and the no HOA means your payments and living here will be even more affordable. This house is 1,108 square feet. It's in great shape. We're going to go take a look at it. All right, we've got a nice upgraded fence on each side. Like that paint. Brand new. Those cute little buds ready for spring for the camellias. Got some lilies there. Ligustrum. And again, that nice upgraded fence. Look at that wall. Beautiful paint. Under the carport here, that leads inside to the utility room. The thing that you will love about this, nice tropical feeling. Not only do we have curb appeal, but when you walk in, look at that. Totally upgraded. We've got a gas stove. A big 120 gallon gas propane tank buried in the back. We've got newer stainless steel appliances, just like everybody wants and asks for. Washer and dryer included. Look at those built ins, that is beautiful. Lots of extra storage. About three or four years ago, the electrical service was upgraded. Of course, it's a beautiful job. There's an upgraded water heater as well. It's about as nice as you get for one right there. And look at the quality of that floor. It's engineered hardwood, the living areas, the slate. Shows a lot of taste. 
Make you look good for living here. Look at that floor, not a ding, not a mark. Beautiful, solid glass. The house was replumbed in 1998, so you don't need to worry about that. Look at these cabinets, these counters. Obviously all this is newer and very well done. When you live in a smaller house, concerned about storage, so we've taken maximum advantage of every single opportunity for storage here. Now we're in the hallway. The AC was replaced this year in 2021. That's always a concern. What about the AC? And that is beautiful. Mostly the things you want are how things look. And that's the original tile. Kept really nicely. You can't just buy, you can't go to Home Depot and just buy tile in that color anymore. The nice updates, low profile upgraded toilets, plenty of room to keep your stuff, nice fixtures. Lots of closets, of course. And you've got the three bedrooms, two baths. Notice those blinds, those aren't cheap. Everything, including that paint, that's fresh. A toilet. A shower big enough for you and a friend. And that's the size of these bathrooms. So if we're given the size that they made them, we've taken maximum advantage, made everything nice. Get the original charm of the color of the tile. It's still done everything possible. Look at that. To make it homey, warm, and inviting. Here we are in the third bedroom. Again, there's not a mark on the wall. Not a spot. Look at those baseboards just installed all through the house. Go price those out. You'll find that that is a major upgrade. Not just in the cost of materials, but in the cost of the workmanship as well. And as we're walking by, we stop and look at the AV closet. Perfect for a Wi-Fi repeater. You want to make sure you get Wi-Fi coverage in the backyard. Hook up your television there. It's already pre-wired for cameras, which you'll see everywhere. But the best part is, yeah, the inside's nice. That's 1,100 square feet, so I'm really going to want some room to run, you know, room for my kids and my dogs. I mean, just had a place for my pets. It was tropical and nice and easy mate. Oh, here it is, easy mate. This is it right here. Look at this. Imagine your kids, your dogs. Got a septic system here. It was this last pump just a couple months ago. Got the seal of approval. Want a place to hang out outside on nice days? We got your pre-installed hammock poles right there. Got your bird of paradise. And yeah, all this looks nice, but I really want some fruit trees, you know, to get back to the land. Oh, those are plantain trees right there. Don't like plantains. How about Florida avocados? There are so many avocados on that tree right now. Look at how tall that is. Imagine avocados almost falling into your mouth. And then what's better yet, we've got Guinness's Book of World Record, the world's largest pecan tree here. Real pecans fall to the ground, pick them up and eat them just like your ancestors did. 
all organic, all natural. Go with your banana plantain trees. Yeah, but if I just had a place that I could entertain guests. Oh my goodness, it's new, it's upgraded. Cute as can be. Look at the architectural details there. And this is solid. Look at how the electrical was put in here. This is not going anywhere. That's adorable. Have a party. Sit here at your bar. Make margaritas for your friends. Let your kids and the dogs play. Wait for avocados to fall. For pecans to fill your larder. Yeah, I know what you're saying. That's all well and good. But I really need a storage shed. Oh, we've got a storage shed here. But I'd like it to be big. Oh, well, this one's big. But most importantly, it's got to be nice. Well, how nice? This one's so nice. Look at that. You can move your kids in here and have them live out here. They'd probably like it. Yeah, so we got a big storage shed, and now my kids are living in there. I really wish we had another one. But what's this? Not just a potting bench, but another storage shed for more things. Upgraded fence. Beautifully manicured trees. Look at those avocados. Makes you hungry. Just looking at them. So if you've been thinking about a home like this near downtown, no, no HOA, move in ready, all the major systems upgraded, beautiful for a single person or for a family and pets, you need to call me. Top Orlando Realtor Scott Garrison with Remax Town & Country. This one's probably not going to hang around for too long. If you like this or one like it, you should be using your phone. Not to watch this video. Pick it up and give me a call now. My info's attached. You should buy this.